thanks for tuning into channel peace if you can find it if you make it to the end of the video or even in the middle and you like what you hear thus far hit the like button much obliged that's a protocol of yt I look at a lot of videos that I like and I don't hit the like button. So I would like to speak on this 17 year old who makes color changing sutures that detect infection. And she's from what um, the super wealthy have turned these countries into a third world, they call it, because they're being pillaged. That's why they third world. That's what I've learned now that, and people are leaving their country and immigrants are running because their country has been torn apart by sanctions and to no fault of their own. Because each country should be, if democracy, right, be able to govern themselves and be thriving and healthy and taking care of their citizens first, right? And then whoever wants whatever afterwards, that's fine. Just take care of home first. Because you know people going to rebel after so long. If you're taking all their goods, I mean, you just, now you're giving them 1% of all their resources. Come on now, you asking for, for trouble. They're going to rebel. But this 17 year old, these prodigies, the government sweep them up. And they're the one that make these uh, WMDs. But why did anyone speak about that? About strangers here. But oh yeah, I want to get back to Joy Reid. She was a prodigy. She went to one of their, uh, what you call it, uh, highfalutin colleges and when you're brilliant like that they come and get you or either she was a star in one of her colleges she was just a brilliant person joy reed uh, the tv uh, i don't know what channel but they came and got her and took her to they groomed her for them so these people are obligated or either they have pictures on them. They have to pay what's due. You know, fair exchange ain't no robbery. So they have to do what they're told. But now they have turned on Biden. And all of them done it at the same time. And if you ever saw that FB uh, video where it tells you what real journalism is right now uh, in this country. And they all speak the same language because they're given a piece of paper. So they're given another piece of paper now that say, down with Biden. So I don't know. They got a plan. But I'm not into politics. But it's just amazing. This game that they playing. And they so close to pushing buttons. Um, uh, U.S. is getting ready to give some of their weapons to Taiwan. And Taiwan belongs to China. They just push you to the edge. It's like, is this a game that all of them playing with us? Or is this for real? Because if they push the button, don't they know all these beautiful channels of shorts, all these happy people doing their lives wonderful. And you see them in, all over the world. And they living good. They living good. So all that's going to disappear. So they don't even know about this part of the world that's getting ready to push a button. And make all of this, everything disappear. Even them and their children. Don't they understand that? So I'm just saying to myself, self, is this a game that they playing? Don't they know that they got to come out from underground and drink the water and breathe the air? And how much food do you have in your bungalow? How long can it last? Are they thinking this through? Because that's how my mind is thinking. But I'm going to end with that piece if you can find it. Thanks for tuning in and listening to this channel. Much obliged. I don't understand this place. Leave me a comment if you do. And we're bringing our children here. We got to leave them here. 
I just turned 70 uh, on the 20th. And I have two ch children here. And I'm just glad I don't have anybody else to worry about. Because this is a place. I, I, I just don't understand children that are being born here now. What they are facing. Huh? What they have to face. And and uh, so since I'm hearing allegedly that the U.S. is very closely tied, and I'm not talking about nothing new, with the uh, I-S-R-A-E-L, and Biden himself said that he was a, a Z-I-O-N-I-S-T. So they're drafting now their orthodox. The ones that wear the curls and, and, and the hat, they bringing them in. And they are pitching a twist up. And so, what is it? They have to follow suit over here. So now they're getting ready to draft. Draft now. And you don't have to sign up. It's going to be automatic. Our 18-year-old and 26-year-olds. Huh? And I said before, black children, we're, they're not patriots. They just looking for benefits and they get out the basement and off of mama's couch and get out the hood. But it's worse in there. That and now they're hiring or letting these all these people in from all over everywhere. It's just to be used to be just Caucasian you had to deal with. Now you got to deal with gangs from all over the world that are enlisting just to get their families over here. And a lot of uh, high operas and just in general are leaving. Because they don't approve of what's going on. It's just, I don't understand this place. I don't understand this place that, that, that what's the word, monanical? They can't see it through or either just, it's just got to be a game that they plan. Because when you're pushing somebody to the end, Russia has his submarines uh, back Cuba. And NATO, which is the U.S., they sending their weapons uh, just the other day. Something, uh, some bombs were landing. I saw it in the water going, choo, choo, just dropping in the water. I thought it was fish jumping up, but it was bombs being dropped on a, a Russian beach. And Russia said they know who did it. And they just tired of the BS now. And I think they let them have it with the Ukraine. They're getting ready to put their foot down because some citizens were unalive, annihilated, pulverized. So you piss some people off. And there's red lines in the sand. You're pushing them, you know. And so they don't want to push it because if they push it, then that means their people and them too. We're all just going to be toast. So who wants to push it? So you figure, what's the point of having it if you never push it? Because if you push it, you just might as well push it on yourself too. You see? That's a trick bag. That's catch 22. You can't push it because then <laughs> you're going to too. I'm going to end with that. So that's something to think about. In this chessboard game that they're playing, and it has nothing to do with the small people down here, but yet they want to automatically draft your child who just want to get out the hood that is uh, uh, just magically dis uh, designed ghetto and hood life. Manufactured. So they running from that. And see there, it's all by design. They do that, and then they'll get your child to want to enlist. Just make it miserable for them in, 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 in the hood life. It's not glamorous and glorious. And then you go in there, and it's just like a city of its own, too, like prison. They come up missing all kind of things. R-A-P-E-D. A lot of horrible things happen over there in there and they overseas and like these soldiers when they go over uh, other countries where you think they getting their sex from huh and it's more males in there than it is females huh that's like a setup that's catch 22 that's that's a trick bag 
and you looking all hot and glamorous and glorious. You look like a pork chop sandwich or not that maybe. You look like a, a fried chicken sandwich or whatever they like to eat. Whoever is that hungry. And they end up just taking your child. And then you disappear. You disappear. So I'm going to end. Thanks for tuning in and listening. These are some long videos. Thanks for tuning in and listening to Channel Peace if you could find it.